Uh, the primary concern when he was on duty today was to make sure that uh, we didn't have a repeat offense with someone else and the public safety was number one concern and the uh, safety of our victim. And hearing from the sheriff there tonight as we're following breaking news out of Eastern Kern County, a sheriff's deputy arrested and facing allegations of sexual assault. Kern County Sheriff Donnie Youngblood holding a press conference earlier this afternoon, sharing more details about the investigation. 23 ABC's Josh Sanders was at the conference and joins us now live with the new information about the case that we're learning tonight. Josh. Good evening, Jessica. That press conference was not long. Sheriff Donnie Youngblood very serious about the allegations of sexual assault against one of his own. Today, KCSO announced and they arrested Deputy Michael Clark on a range of charges. They say their office received information yesterday. The alleged assault taking place August 24th. A 21 year old woman says Clark offered her a ride home while she was walking home from the Starbucks she works in in Rosamond. She accepted and while in his Patrol car. She says he forced himself on her, which included kissing, fondling, and even exposing himself. She says the assault lasted around 20 minutes and she wasn't allowed to leave the car. Over the next several days, she says Clark messaged her on social media and would even come to the Starbucks. Sheriff Donna Youngblood says the victim then told her co workers and the company contacted his office. Just to, just to clarify, real quick, sorry. Um, you you said that the alleged victim reported the assault to her co-workers at Starbucks? She, she reported to her place of employment. Which would be Starbucks? That's correct. And then from there, she then notified... Actually, we were notified by the company that this had occurred, and we then went out and contacted the, the victim and, uh, and asked her what, to tell us what had happened. So that Starbucks notified you? That's correct. Now again, Clark was arrested this afternoon while on duty. He's currently being interviewed by detectives. He's facing charges of false imprisonment, kidnapping, sexual battery, and assault under the color of authority. The sheriff's office tells me Clark has only been with the department for two and a half years. According to policy, even though he was arrested today, he is going to be on paid administrative lead as the investigation continues. Of course, this is something that we will continue to follow on our social media platforms and website at turner23.com. For now, in Oildale, Josh Sanders, 23ABC, connecting you.